in this lesson we will be learning about while loop so this is the syntax of while loop while then parenthesis inside the parenthesis condition then begin then statement then end while loop is not synthesizable but it is a very useful construct for test benches and verification okay so when we check the functionality of our design it is very helpful this while loop is very helpful uh for test benches okay so if i write the, so this is the condition this is the uh, syntax okay you have to remember if i write while then parenthesis one then it runs forever this this loop runs forever okay infinitely for infinite time okay while one always at the rate passage of clock means positive edge of clock this is one example then begin while test equal to equal to 0 begin count count equal to count plus 1 then end then end this code is not synthesizable okay and why this code is not synthesizable because uh, during the compile time it is not known actually so for how many for how many times uh, the loop is going to run because if test this condition won't satisfy then what will happen suppose if test is not equal to equal to zero then so how many times how many times this uh, loop is going to run during compile time it is not determined okay it is indetermined okay so this is so that's why the synthesis tool won't be able to generate a proper hardware for this one for for this code so that is one of the reason and that is the reason why this code is not synthesizable because the synthesis tools need to be able to know the number of times it will run because if the synthesis tool won't be able to know uh, during the uh, compile time that how many times the loop is going to run then how it is going to generate a hardware for that code because when we write a piece of code and when when we synthesize that one then synthesis tool what it will do it will convert that uh, convert a hardware for that piece of code for every for e because when we are writing a when we are writing a code for digital logic that every digital logic it infers a corresponding hardware and if synthesis tool is not able to generate a hardware for a particular code then definitely it is not synthesizable one okay See the loop provided above, above might run once because if test equal to equal to zero, if this condition satisfies, then count equal to count plus one. What if if the count equal to one? Uh, sorry, uh, if test equal to equal to one, then the the uh, loop won't be able to run for a single time also. Okay. So uh, the loop provided above might run once or maybe many times or never. So synthesis tool cannot generate a correct hardware and thus will not be able to synthesis the loop for example if test equal to 1 then the code will never run and if test equal to 0 it will run forever for example if it is test equal to equal to 0 then this 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 will run forever this count the count will be for every cycle say for every positive edge of clock the count will be the count value will be updated so how the synthesis tool is going to generate a hardware for the, such kind of logic every time for every positive edge of clock uh, the count is the count is evaluated and count the count there is increment one increment for that uh, count so synthesis tool won't be able to generate a real hardware okay so this is one of the reason why this this code is this code is not synthesis not synthesizable one and while loop and while loop is generally not synthesizable okay but it is it is a useful construct in simulations okay and during that functionality check and during that verification rtl verification this while loop is very very useful during the test bench writing okay so this is a code for your 7 bit counter using while loop so integer count initial begin count equal to 0 and 
then this is count this is count is initialized okay means count equal to 0 now so while count less than 128 means so begin display this is dollar display okay so this is a for monitoring the for monitor input and output monitoring purpose okay this display then count equal to uh, count equal to d then count count equal to count plus 1 so it will count 0 to 127 okay 0 1 to 127 okay then next is 128 then 129 then 130 then what will happen continuously it will be checking this this one this condition count if count less than 128 if count is less than 128 then there won't be increment for count okay count value so it will count 2 to the power 7 means 128 means 0 to 127 it will count up to 127 and this while loop can be used uh, for generating a clock also so uh, you remember this one while while one if you write while one then the loop will run forever okay for infinite time so so this is a uh, output range block this is a clock you can generate a clock uh, using this while while loop okay then uh, clock equal to 0 so initially this in clock equal to 0 this part then while one means this is infinite loop begin after five five time five a uh, time step clock equal to inverted of clock so this will be 0 then 1 then 0 then 1 so this is the output okay this is the test bench web form view this is so if you if you run the same code if you run the so same code in your simulator then uh, you will get the same result okay so it is it is a clock generation using the while loop uh, this is how this uh, while loop works so you have to re what you have to remember is this while loop is not synthesizable one but it is very very useful construct design uh, during our uh, functionality check that is uh, test bench uh, during the test uh, when we check our when we verify our logic so that is during the test test bench writing okay and uh, why this is not synthesizable in case if they ask why it is not synthesizable then you can ask you can say that uh, during the compile time your synthesis tool won't be able to know that how, for how many times uh, logic is your logic is going to run your or your synthesis tool is going to run that loop so that is one of the reason because if the number of times during the compile time if the number of times it is not known then generating a hardware is very difficult so th uh, this is one of the reason why this while loops are not synthesizable okay so this is all about a uh, while loop and i hope that you guys uh, learned something and if you like the content then please do like and subscribe this channel thank you so much for watching